Ms. Garcia is in her second year of teaching with Fort Worth ISD. And this year, she's teaching seventh graders a mighty big subject, Texas history. While Ms. Garcia is excited to hear that Fort Worth ISD is participating in teacher incentive allotment, her teaching assignment is not eligible for consideration yet. The good news is I can still be part of TIA. And here's how. If her campus has one or more designated teachers, a percentage of the TIA funds are pooled to be shared with teachers, like me, who are not teaching a TIA eligible course. Teachers who are eligible to earn their own designation are not included in this shared TIA pool since they may earn their own allotment. This year, Ms. Garcia's campus has one designated teacher, which means money is generated for a shared pool for the campus. To receive part of these funds, Ms. Garcia must be a teacher at winter class roster verification in February and be a Fort Worth ISD employee when TIA funds are paid. Non-eligible teachers may change campus assignments or roles after the winter class roster verification date, but they will receive funds based on their assignment at winter class roster. Ms. Garcia is looking forward to when her teaching assignment is eligible for TIA. Until then, she enjoys guiding and inspiring her students to greater academic growth working with her designated colleagues, and receiving my part of the campus-shared TIA pool.